We're outside on my portal. We're at about 6,500 feet. And uh, Linda, can did you get a shot of Wheeler Peak over there? Mm -hmm. At 13,200 some odd feet? Yeah, it looks really small from here, but... Yeah. Doesn't it? Yeah. Well, you know what? Anybody who wants to come join me and climb that mountain, if you do it with me, you have dinner with us, and I send you home with a whole basket of my goods. All right. Tonight, we're going to do some spare ribs. We got ourselves our charcoal fire going. We're barbecuing. We're barbecuing. I put my special rub on this. And you know what? If anybody wants to get my special rub, all you got to do is email me. Okay? We're going to put this on the grill. Can I get your special rub? <laughs> Thank you, Linda. <laughs> Everybody hear that? Linda wants my special rub. We're going to put that on the grill. We've got half the grill with charcoal, half without. So in a minute or two, we're going to move this over. We're going to, I'm over here, baby. I'm still over here. Yeah. We're going to move back inside. We're going to make some coleslaw. Um, we're going to talk about the special dry rub, talk about the barbecue sauce I made, talk about the uh, coleslaw I'm making, and talk about the uh, jumping jalapeno jam. And everybody, you know what? You guys are running 63 to 37% in favor of me cutting, uh, keeping my ponytail, keeping my ponytail. Come on now, I want some more action here. I want some more answers, okay? So I'm going to flip this over right now, get it to the other side of the grill where it's in indirect, on indirect heat, okay? Everybody got that? Okay, see you inside. Linda, go pour us some wine, okay? Because you remember what, Linda? Red wine with meat. And? White wine with fish. And what do we do with ribs? Ah, we'll talk about that later. Okay, inside. Go there with you. Hey, Lin oh, Linda, you got everybody here? Okay, great. The ribs are on the grill, right? Mm -hmm. Indirect heating. So we're gonna make some coleslaw. I got three cups of shredded cabbage. What you do? I got one cup of shredded onions, red onions, the sweeter, and a half cup of shredded uh, carrots. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna make a little coleslaw. And you know what? I got my barbecue sauce. On. Linda, come over here. Got my barbecue sauce made. Oh, it's so good. And you know what? I did my dry rub earlier, which I rubbed the ribs with. So here we go. We're gonna put in a tablespoon of chipotle, cider vinegar, and about three tablespoons. Dijon mustard, two tablespoons. Celery salt. And a tablespoon of celery salt. Kosher salt, tablespoon. And maybe a little less. A little less than a tablespoon. And of course, mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. You remember that movie, that officer and gentleman? Mayonnaise? What a great movie that was. How much mayonnaise? Remember that? What? How much mayonnaise? Until we need enough. Do you remember that movie, Officer and Gentleman, with uh, 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 Gossett and uh, uh, Richard Gere? Remember? And you called them mayonnaise? Uh, okay, that's a, I guess I'm showing my age. Anyway, we're going to mix this up. Put this together into a nice coleslaw. Let me tell you one thing about coleslaw. You can never add enough what, Linda? Mayonnaise. That's right. You can <laughs> never add enough mayonnaise. So we're probably going to need a little more here. Come on, guys. There you go. Oh, that's good. Out. I'm over here, Linda. Yeah, well, your mayonnaise is right here. Alan Miguel's famous mayonnaise, and let me tell you something, people love this <laughs> <No. 
Sorry? That'd be the favorite number with me. <laughs> okay. So Linda lost it there for a minute. I said. Alan Miguel's famous fan, and it's not, it's my famous coleslaw. And my potato salad, which I really am famous for, you have no idea. People call me from all over the world asking for this. And you know what? I'll be happy to, oh, God, look at that. Can I, can I look, or are you gonna yell at me? I'm getting close. That's yummy. That's perfect. Now you know what we're gonna do? Listen, we're gonna start selling things online, you guys, buy a nine ounce jar of the dry rub. Email me. Twenty dollars, it lasts you six months at least. Jump in jalapeno jam. <laughs> Eight dollars a jar plus shipping and handling. Sixteen ounce jar of my barbecue sauce. Oh man. Hey, remember, the hundredth person who emails me and I don't care whether you want me to cut my ponytail or not, but the hundredth person, ah, the hundredth person who emails me gets a free gift basket from me. Okay? You know what? We're gonna check out our ribs. We've got that done. That's done. Um, we're cool. All right, we're gonna just listen to some music, drink some wine, um, watch some, uh, no, listen to some music, and maybe watch some baseball. It's break time baseball, and we'll be back in a little while. Okay? See you in a little while. Hey, you back? You know what we forgot? Silly us, we forgot the sugar. Three tablespoons of sugar. Don't forget that, otherwise it's like uh, tart. Don't forget the sugar, okay? Linda, how'd it taste? With the sugar, Linda, how'd it taste? With the sugar, it tasted delicious. Can I get an Ariba? Ariba, Ariba! Uh, well, you know what, Linda's tired. Don't deal well.